May I call on Malam Mujahid to give us our opening prayers. The Muslim, Muslim, Muslim opening prayers. And Ms. Mrs. Neka, our acting dean for Faculty of Allied Health Sciences, to give us the Christian opening prayers, respectively. Thank you very much. The beneficent, the most hopeful, Salah, or Nabil Karim, Salah, Sayyidina Muhammad, Wala, Ali Muhammad, Masalita, Ala Ibrahim, Wala, Ibrahim, Marikala Muhammad, Wala, Ali Muhammad, Mubarak, Ala Ibrahim, Wala, Ibrahim, in the Kamil. Ya Allah, as we have come here for this grand ceremony, may we see it through. Um, may you enable us to conduct this activity successfully, and may we all return to our home safely. Amen. Salam alaikum. In Jesus' name, Father, we want to thank you for a day like this. We want to appreciate you. We want to worship you. We said, let your name be exalted in the name of Jesus. Thank you for Johnny Mercy for our father from Zaria and his team. We thank you, Lord. We ask, oh God, that everything that we are going to do here today, Father, shall be successful in the mighty name of Jesus. That when our father and his team will be going back and every one of us, which are returned safely without any issue in Jesus' name. Thank you, Father, because you have answered in the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you very much. May I also respectively uh, ask us to rise to observe a minute of silence for five of our students and the staff that were killed during the banditry attack on 20th April 2021. Please let us rise in their honor. They are so raised in perfect peace. Amen. You can be seated. The Chancellor, sir, Chancellor of Greenfield University, His Royal Highness, Ambassador Ahmed Nu Bamali, CFR, LLD, MA of Zazo, Founder and Pro Chancellor, Greenfield University, Engineer Chief Simon. Fedora Owakacha, Owa of Umere, wife of the Pro Chancellor, Mrs. Joy Owakacha, who is also a member of the University Board of Trustees and Managing Director of Imperial School. Members of the Board of Trustees present, members of the University Council present, the Vice Chancellor. Professor John Olu Coris Eyedogbon, members of the University Senate and management, academic directors and other director present, professors and other senior lecturers, officials from Kaduna State's Ministry of Education and other agencies from Kaduna State, parents, guardian present. Students of Greenfield University, gentlemen of the press, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen. Today marks a significant milestone in the history of Greenfield University as we witness the culmination of hard work, dedication, and sheer vision to create an environment that fosters learning growth and innovation. The creation of this state of the art of lecture theater symbolizes our commitment to providing our students with the best possible resources to excel 
in their academic pursuit. As we look around this beautifully designed space, we see more than just a wall and seats, but we see a place where ideas will be shared, knowledge will be imparted, and lifelong memories will be created. This lecture theatre will serve as a beacon of inspiration, a hub of intellectual resources, and a centre for collaboration among the brightest minds of our campus. Greenfield University was established in February 2019 by the federal government of Nigeria after getting the approval from the National University Commission. And the university became operational in June same year. The university started with two faculties, namely Faculty of Science and Technology and Faculty of Social and Management Sciences. But in 2021, the university established the Faculty of Engineering to run Bachelor of Engineering in Civil, Electrical, Electronics, and Mechanical Engineering. Also, in 2023, the university also established Faculty of Allied Health Sciences to run degree programs in nursing science, medical laboratories, and doctor of physiotherapy. Plans are underway to establish Faculty of Medicine, Law, and School of Postgraduate Studies. Currently, the university has a population of about 400 students. It is therefore my singular honor and privilege, on behalf of the founder and pro-chancellor of Greenfield University, Chief Simon Ifeodora Onwakacha, the owner of Umoeri, the Vice Chancellor, Professor John Olukoris Eadogbon, and University Senate to invite our Chancellor, His Royal Highness, the Emir of Zozo, Ambassador Ahmed Nubamali, CFR LLD, to declare this memorable occasion open. Thank you so much. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Uh, Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wa barakatuh. By the authority conferred on me as Chancellor of Greenfield University, I declare this um, occasion open. So thank you. Let us give another round of applause for our Chancellor. There is something very unique about our Chancellor. Our Chancellor, I call him the Chancellor of the Chancellor, he is because he is the only Nigerian and only traditional ruler to hold the position of Chancellor about four universities at the same time. It has never happened in the history of Nigeria. And I'll tell you, His Royal Highness 
He's the Chancellor of Greenfield University in Kaduna State, where we are today. Please a round of applause. <laughs> he is also the Chancellor of the University of Jos in Plateau State. <laughs> he is the Chancellor to Uda University in Zamfara State. <laughs> and he is the Chancellor to Capital University in Kano State. Please, I will seek your indulgence. <laughs> your Royal Highness, we are proud of you, and we are proud to be associated with you. But Greenfield is your namo namo, as my pro chancellor used to say. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. We appreciate you, sir. Distinguished guests, Distinguished ladies and gentlemen, I have the singular honor and privilege of inviting the man of the moment, the founder of Greenfield University, Chief Simon Ifedora Onwakacha, to deliver his welcome address. Mr. Pro Chancellor, sir. Mr. Pro Chancellor, sir. Chancellor of Greenfield University, His Royal Highness Ambassador Ahmed Nuru Bamali, Emma of Zazo, CFR, and LLD. My registrar was looking for my trouble. He, he broke the news to all presidents. You have heard what he said that our chancellor is also chancellor to many other universities. But I told, the, I told my chancellor that he's chancellor of Greenfield University for life. You know, in the University of Jos, we are aware of uh, federal government policies. After some time, they say the of policy has become this, only of event has become this. I told him that he is chancellor of Greenfield for life. And that is why uh, he used my popular words, that the chancellor is uh, other chancellors. I refer to them as uh, them, them. Yes. But Greenfield chancellor is namu namu. <laughs> So I'm happy and proud to be associated with the, our chancellor, and uh, he, he has been working hard to see us uh, come out of our earlier problems. And I'm proud to say that we are doing well. I have the honor to present to you my speech on this great day that we are honoring our sister, Zena Sunshina Ahmed, with the naming of this uh, beautiful uh, lecture theater after her. What makes this lecture theater uh, great is that it's a modern lecture theater. From this, my podium, we are connected to the whole world. And I'm quite convinced that Zenab may be seeing all of us here. And this is our lecture theater. Our podium is interactive. 
interactive in the sense that uh, with your fingers you can do whatever you want to do. And I tell you, my teachers are anxious to take over. My teachers are anxious to take over. My students are anxious to take over this place. And I look forward to the day I'll come here and somebody tells me, we used to be in the lecture theater. Here is my speech. Chancellor Greenfield University for Life, His Royal Highness Ambassador Ahmed Lou Bamali, Emma of Zazao, CFR, LLD, wife of uh, the Pro Chancellor, my own, Visitor Imwakacha, who is also the managing director of the Imperial School. Members of the Board of Trustees here present, I can see a couple of them. Members of the University Council, I can see a couple of them. The Vice Chancellor. Members of the University Senate. Academic directors and other directors present. Professors and other senior lecturers in the University. Officials from Kaduna State Ministry of Education. My dear parents, guardians present here, invited guests, students of Greenfield University, other stakeholders here present, gentlemen of the press, many of them are here, ladies and gentlemen. It is with great, great pleasure and pride that I welcome our Chancellor, His Royal Highness, Ambassador Amenu Bamali, CFR, Emma of Zazo and all our special guests to this momentous occasion. We have gathered here to inaugurate and celebrate the official opening of Zainab Shansuna Ahmed Lecture Theatre, a monumental achievement and a testament to our commitment to providing an exceptional learning environment for our students. This state-of-the-art lecture theater, equipped with modern teaching facilities and the 200 seating capacity, stands as a symbol of our dedication to excellence in education. This our lecture theater too is equipped with infants, inverter, and solar panels, which means that if we are doing anything here, we will not mind. Nobody will take our lives. So this lecture theater can stand on its own. The establishment of this facility not only exemplifies our unwavering commitment to academic advancement, but also pays homage to the remarkable contribution of a distinguished individual who has made significant impact in our nation and beyond. Zenam has not only been an outstanding leader, but also a trailblazer in the field of finance, budget, and national planning. Throughout her illustrious career as an accountant, and later as a Minister of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, she has demonstrated dedication, vision, and unwavering commitment to the development of our country. It is only fitting that we honor her legacy by naming this exceptional lecture theatre after her. The Zenam Ahmed Lecture Theatre will serve as a hub for intellectual discourse, collaborative learning, and the exchange of knowledge. It will be a space where the next generation of leaders, innovators, and visionaries will gather to be inspired, challenged, and empowered to make a positive impact on the world. As we stand here today, we are not only celebrating the inauguration of a building, but also commemorate the values and ideals that Zeneb Sansuna Ahmed embodies. Integrity, excellence, and the relentless pursuit of progress. Her leadership and contributions have set a standard for all of us to strive towards. 
and the lecture theater will serve as a constant reminder of the impact that passionate individuals can have on the world around them. I would like to express my deep gratitude to the management of Greenfield University for their foresight and commitment to creating an environment that fosters academic excellence and innovation. I extend my heartfelt appreciation to all the faculties, staff, and students who have worked tirelessly to bring this vision to fruition, ensuring that the Zenab Samsuna Ahmed Lecture Theater stands as a beacon of educational advancement and inspiration. I also want to recognize the continued support of our esteemed Chancellor, His Royal Highness, the Emma of Zazo, whose guidance and dedication has played and his vision for excellence and unwavering commitment to the advancement of education has been instrumental in, in shaping the future of our institution. To the dignities and guests present here today, I urge you to witness the impact of collective vision, passion, and dedication in creating a space that will shape the minds and future of generations to come. The Zainab Samsuna Ahmed Lecture Theater is a testament to what can be achieved when we come together with a shared purpose and a commitment to building a brighter future. May I also use this opportunity to pay a glowing tribute to the late father of our celebrant, Malam Yahya Hamza, whose passion for education, his unwavering dedication to excellence, and his visionary leadership have laid the foundation upon which we stand today. <laughs> Malam Yahya Hamza was an educationist for excellence, and there's no way one can disembark on this chapter new chapter in the history of Greenfield University, let us forward the, spirit, uh, forward the spirit of innovation, celebration, and commitment to excellence that the Sansuna Ahmed Lecture Theater represents. May this space